A North Carolina man in custody tonight accused of shooting a six-year-old girl and her parents over a basketball that rolled into his yard. Robert Singletary is being held in Florida on a fugitive warrant, and when he's sent back to North Carolina, he'll face four counts of attempted murder. Here's ABC's Ariel Reshev. Tonight, the North Carolina man accused of shooting a six-year-old girl and her parents over a stray basketball, waving extradition in Florida. Mr. Singletary, you're here on a fugitive warrant from North Carolina. It does not have a bond. Are you going to sign the waiver of extradition form today? Indeed. Thank you, sir. Robert Singletary surrendering in Tampa, 500 miles from the crime scene he fled, leading authorities on an urgent 48-hour manhunt. Singletary now facing multiple charges, including four counts of attempted first-degree murder after police say he opened fire on his neighbors just outside of Charlotte on Tuesday. Bullet fragments hitting six-year-old Kinsley White's left cheek. Why did you shoot my daddy and me? Kinsley's father, William White, who ran to protect her, also shot. Her mother grazed. This shooting, one of at least four this week, where everyday occurrences from a wrong turn into a driveway to knocking on the wrong door ended in gunfire. It's an absolute travesty that what should have just been a mild conversation with a child about anything turned into someone getting shot. Wait, Singletary was armed when he surrendered. Now we know that the father is recovering in the ICU. He's doing better. The family telling us that they are glad that their neighbor is in custody. Wit. Just an awful story. Ariel, thank you. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.